about as close to flying that you're going to get without a plane uh, or, you know, parachute or anything like that. You sit down in a harness, cross your legs, and then take off. A smooth ride down a cable that stretches hundreds of feet over the serene landscape of Pelotas. You can zip along up to 42 miles an hour. May not sound fast, oh, but it is. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of people go, well, that's not very fast. I said, well, let me strap you to the front of the car and I'll accelerate to 40 miles an hour and hit the brakes and we gotta stop, you know, and you tell me if it's not fast. There are 10 lines and that includes the practice run. Okay. You can take off from the ground or climb towers as tall as 110 feet to start your excursion, eventually ending up back at home base. Not only is zip lying an incredible way to experience the beauty of the hill country, but it's also a very unique way to preserve this land, land that's been in this family for generations. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> My great great grandfather uh, came over from, I believe, Poland, and then they purchased the property in smaller sections or smaller acreage. And then uh, they had it mainly, I believe, it was for farming and agricultural purposes. By the time the Madla family finished buying land, they had 1,200 acres of hill country. Over the years, the land has been divided up and passed down. Some families sold theirs, others held on to theirs, which means sections have been in the family for seven generations. In order to maintain it, Rodney Matla and his sister Michelle wanted to take 68 acres, create a financial impact for the family, while keeping the impact on the environment low. The zip line is kind of a low impact as far as the land is concerned. We've looked at UTVs, ATVs, but it's it's you know uh, it's kind of hard on the on the property. So zip lining, um, you know, once you have your uh, infrastructure in, it's pretty simple to maintain the land. The zip line allows visitors to enjoy the isolation of the hill country. Magnificent 360 degree views. A lot of wildlife out here that is being displaced because of the development. And so uh, that being said, we, we, we try to at least maintain them. There you go. They also offer another opportunity for guests to enjoy the great outdoors, a game rising in popularity, disc golf. It's the one form of entertainment that gives a great view and keeps you on the ground. After visitors have enjoyed a day of play, they can top it off with a seat and a drink at the beer garden. Woo! And then zip back another day to do it all over again. All right, come on up. Oh, I got you, I got you. <laughs> I'm getting closer every time. I got you.